Hi dear Pisces, a very very good afternoon to you guys. This is Anjali Tarot and this is a general love reading for all the Pisces Sun, Moon, Venus rising. Keep in mind this is general. It might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing the rules can be reversed anytime. Third thing this is a reading from today till the end of July. So let's start your partner's current feelings for you right now are Pisces. Let's see. Your partner's current feelings for you right now are. Let's see what's happening. Hanged man, somebody stuck on you, not able to move on, not able to stay, and they are very courageous. Somebody is silent actually. Somebody is not showing you actually what they are feeling for you, and they are quite stuck on you. You know, quite stuck on this connection, on this relationship. Let me clarify the hanged man. Six of six of wands and seven of wands and the emperor. Okay, they have decided. They they have they carry lots of emotions for you, lots of love for you. They have decided that they are not going to speak up. But uh, the truth is that they feel like you are very gorgeous. You are doing really good in your life, and you are the center of attraction for so many people. And that's kind of a worrisome situation for them. And they are kind of a kind of building a wall around them right now. They feel like uh, I don't want to get myself hurt again. You know, I'm just going to protect myself, and I have decided that I'm just going to wait. For some of you, they feel like uh, they can get married to you in the future because six of wands is card of marriage as well for in this particular deck. But uh, I do see right now they are feeling like they should create a wall around them because they don't want to end up hurting themselves. Okay, got it. Still very much stuck on you, but not able to say anything about it, do anything about it. Could be dealing with an Aries or Aries with Sagittarius. Let's see what you feel for this person, Pisces. Your feelings for them right now. King of Swords, okay. Page, King of Pentacles might be dealing with two people at the same time. Who knows? But I do see you are very cold and off and detached towards them. You are closed off. You are pissed off with this person. You are like, I'm not going to talk to you. You suck. It's like this. Okay, you are giving them a very hard time. Very, very hard time. Let me clarify the King of Swords. Let's see what's happening. King of Swords is clarified. The King of Swords, the Swords, and Knight of Pentacles, and Four of Cups. Okay, okay. You are like uh, you are slowly but surely you are trying to move on from the situation. See, uh, you are cold and often detached. But the thing is, you are not able to move on. You are still still so much stuck on this person. You have options. You do have options, but you are not interested in those options. You are quite bored, and you are like, I don't need anybody right now, because you are still so much energetically stuck on this person. That is why you are not able to, you know. See the other options and uh, show interest in the other people. It's like I am just not interested anymore right now, at least. Yeah, got it. Because you're still stuck on them. Slowly but surely, you're trying trying to move on, but not able to do it. Mm -hmm. Okay, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and Aries, uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Let's see what you what this person wants from you, Pisces. Let's see what this person wants from you. I don't okay see I told you this person is on the crossroads uh, they really don't understand what they exactly want but deep down this person wants a higher level of commitment with you and or a marriage you can say with you they want to have a spiritual uh, higher level of commitment or connection with you this is what they want let me clarify the hierophant no god Let's clarify the Hierophant. The Hermit, the Devil and the... Okay, Eight of Cups. Right now they are trying to be single. Okay, it's like uh, slowly but surely. Okay, they are trying to... They want to walk away from the third party. Whatever the third party is. If this is like... Uh, there is a addiction, there is a sex addiction, there is abuses, there are control issues, there are conflicts, there is fights... I don't know whatever, but what that means in this uh, relationship could be a physical person, could be a person uh, like interfering in between you guys, and things are not working out. Slowly, they are they are thinking, are thinking, and thinking a lot about it. They are thinking a lot about uh, the situation to work out between you and them, and they want to walk away from the third party. Or it could be possible that uh, very much possible that they want you to uh, walk out, uh, walk walk away from somebody to be with them 
get married to this person. This is what they want. They want a higher level of commitment. They want a marriage. And they're slowly, uh, they're like silently manifesting that you should walk away from the third party or third person that uh, is interfering in this connection or the vice versa. Okay. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Capricorn energy, Virgo energy and Taurus. Let's see what you want from this connection or from this relationship. Seven of Swords, you want them to speak up. Eight of Pentacles, you want to work on this connection, but you want some kind of secret. You want to tell them some kind of secret or there's some kind of secret that is yet to be revealed. Hmm. From their side, from your side, I don't know. You want the secret thing, you want this mysterious, mysterious things to come out so that you can be very clear and honest with this person within this relationship, within this dynamic. Let me clarify the Seven of Swords. Let's see. Let's let me clarify this. The page of the, the, the nine of pentacles, the five of wands, and the five of pentacles. Okay, the high priestess. You are thinking a lot about the situation. Okay, you want to stay in your power. You want to be independent. You want to end this drama, this fight, this drama, this fight. Okay, there is some kind of you know illusion in this connection there is some kind of mystery regarding this connection and i feel you want to come out of this drama this sense of feeling lost with lost without any reason in this connection you're like i want clarity i want the truth i want to blurt out the truth if there's something that you are hiding you want to blurt out the truth okay you want to end this drama and this feeling of loss and this feeling of uh, you know feeling rejected or uh, the abandonment issues the trust issues that you carry within this dynamic within this connection or from the past might be from the past situation so it's like right now you just want to tell the truth you just want to end this mystery or you want this person to tell you the truth and end this mystery and this uh, dejection and, and this drama and just focus on themselves and you just want to focus on yourself at least for the time being hmm. it's very difficult to explain but I'm trying my best Taurus Prabhu Capricorn and uh, Aries Leo Sagittarius and uh, Gemini Libra Aquarius Let's see what's coming towards you till the 31st of July. Let's see what's coming towards you till the 31st of July. Let's see. Pisces. Come it, okay. Nine of Pentacles. Things are slowly but surely moving on. Moving. Very slowly but yes, things are moving. The hermit is like, is like silence. I feel they will be silent treatment might be you are going to give them silent treatment or they are going to give you silent treatment there, there will be some kind of silence thinking a thinking and thinking about the situation but not doing anything about it it's like this let me clarify the hermit card ten of wands a death card and three of wands oh my god page of cups yeah I feel slowly but surely things are going to end. The, I feel not things, though not this relationship. I think this burdensome situation will end, and your ships will arrive. I will. I feel. I feel like you will slowly but surely you will find something positive, some kind of good news, some kind of uh, positive news is coming towards you. But it's going to be very slow process, okay? Because I do see this is hermit. I don't see this is verbally coming to you or physically coming to you. But you will realize, realize it. You will feel it. That something good is coming towards you. Or someone is coming towards you. Uh, uh, this this uh, whole burdensome situation is uh, getting more, uh, sorry, less and less burdensome now. And something good is coming towards you. Something positive is coming towards you. And you can expect an apology or somebody coming towards you with an option, with an offer of like, I do have emotions for you. Let's see where it goes. It's kind of this, like this. Okay. So Pisces, thank you so much for tuning in. I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye-bye. Take care. God bless you. Namaste.